Hey guys, it's the Emerald Enderman, and this is going to be my first video in my Let's Play of Run With Nature. Run With Nature is a mod pack on the Technic Launcher, and I'll leave a link to the Technic Launcher in the description. It's a really good way to get mod packs for free. You don't have to pay any money, just sign up for account for Technic Launcher, and you get like thousands of mod packs. And it's like really, really fun. This mod pack adds in a whole bunch of new plants, you know, like a whole new world to explore. And it's really, really fun. I don't know all the features of this mod pack yet, so if you guys know something I don't know, post it in the comments. It really helps. So, oh, I see some sheeps. And there's also the hats mod in here, so if I get any hats, I'll probably wear an, uh, a new hat every video. Ow, ow, what, what, what was that? Why am I poisoned? What just poisoned me? Um, so let's put this down. And we'll make a sword so we can get a few of these sheep. I'm prob every hat I see I have to get, no matter what it's on. If it's on a creeper, I have to get it. See, you see what I mean where it adds in new foods? Like, this is a cucumber in a winter squash. You don't get that in regular Minecraft. I... What is... It's you, isn't it? I don't like you. Okay. Sorry. And sheep actually drop food now, called raw mutton. And there, see, like, if you find, like, this is a pea pod. Break it, and look what you get. You got a tomato, a chili pepper, and that's it. So it's, like, really a good way to get food. But it only, all the food only gives you a half a heart unless you cook it. So, like, if, you're not, if you think, oh, I'm just going to eat this and not cook it, and I'll leave off tomatoes for the rest of my life, that won't work. So, just... I'm going to hit this with a cucumber and break it. There. So, where would be a good spot to set up, like, my base? I suppose here would be decent. Because you have this deep, deep cave with a creeper in it. And then this is, like, a sideways awesome window. And if anything comes in, I can get up here and knock them off. So this is, like, the perfect area. So let's set up my crafting table. Sorry for any lag, I just loaded up the world now. So, if there's any lag, it won't happen in the other videos, but in this video it probably will happen pretty bad. I'll try to edit it out as much as I can so it doesn't look laggy. So let's make good enough to make like a furnace and maybe a stone pickaxe and a stone sword, because I want to kill that creeper. I don't want that creeping up on me in the middle of the night. Where I can't see it. So make a furnace. And put down the furnace. And make a few more sticky sticks. And then I want a stone sword. And a stone pickaxe for collecting iron. And coal. And then I'm going to make like a food chest. So over the course of this series. I'm going to have a chest. And in that chest, it'll be all my food that I ever collect, like all the food that's in this mod pack. Just to show you at the end of the series how much food you can actually get. Like, it's, if you have too many items on, it'll take up four pages of too many items. It's that big. So, oh, there, there, we'll get some iron. Creeper. Aww. Uh, wow. Wow. My first death of the game. Wow. I cannot believe that. Wow. Um. Okay. I lost all my stuff. Okay. There's two things I need you guys to post in the comments. The first thing, do you want me to keep too many items on? That means if I die, I keep my items. 
and then the second thing is do you want me to build a house next episode or do you want me to like build a small house next episode or do you want me to wait and build like a massive house so post in the comments And since this is my first video, I'm not exactly sure what um, other types of series I'm going to be doing. I want to do stuff that's original and not already done by other YouTubers. I might be doing something with Lucky Blocks. Just saying. Just a little hint. The Lucky Blocks mod is really fun too, but it's not in this mod pack. You know what? I'm just going to remake a cave. I didn't have much stuff in that other cave anyway. The Lucky Blocks mod is, like, really fun to use. Yeah, the Lucky Blocks mod is, like, really good. So, I'll make another pickaxe. Because I lost my other one due to the fact that the creeper wanted to give me a hug. It exploded from excitement. So, let's just mine this up a little bit. And this will be my little, I guess, shelter for now. It's not that good of a shelter, but it'll do for now. The Carpenter's Blacks mod is really good for building houses. You can make, like, stone um, stairs. I didn't mean to put that piece of cobblestone down. I wanted to put my crafting table down. So we'll put the crafting table down. We could put the furnace next to it. It's really, really good. The look, uh, um, the, 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 um, carpenter's blacksmith. It's very, very useful. So, whoa, 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 what am I going to do? I can make a door. So I'll make a door, and that can go on my shelter. And you can even make like a, a carpenter's door, which you can match it to the textures of the stone. Well, any block, not just stone. So let's go out here. Oh, wait. I'm going to make an axe. Because I want to go mining while I'm down here. Because you can actually make it an awesome thing that they added with Mr. Crayfish's furniture mod. And it, that's the garbage can, or the bin. And you could get, like, let's say you have five stacks of rotten flesh. Toss it all into the bin and hit empty and it's gone forever. It's, like, perfect. But you need, um, you need a lot of iron for it, though. So I'll just get some wood. Go over here. And... Put all the wood and make a whole bunch of sticks. Okay, so what I'm going to do now is I'm going to basically do speed mining. I'm going to mine all the way down, but you're going to get to see it, but it's going to be sped up. So I'll be back in a minute. Hey guys, I'm back from mining, 
and I found 35 pieces of iron. So we're going to smelt that, and now we can make our garbage can that will go right there. So, I think I'm going to speed it up one more time so that the iron gets done quicker. I'll make the garbage can and then end the video. Hey guys, I'm back again, and we're finally going to craft our trash can. So you're going to need two weighted pressure plates, iron around the bottom, and then a piece of stone at the top, and you got a rubbish bin. So pop it down there, and there's our garbage can. So let's say there's something we have to throw away, a, st a wooden pickaxe. Empty. The pickaxe is gone, and this has unlimited uses. So, thank you guys for watching, and I'll see you all next time. And one more thing. Since this episode was kind of short, the next episode I'm going to do is going to be about 20 minutes, and then I'm going to average them about 20 minutes. So, bye!